making involve shaping, drying and firing operations. In many countries this process is very labour intensive. Green bricks are carried to the kiln where the setting is done manually, one brick at a time. Unloading and arranging of the fired bricks in stacks, as well as delivery and handling at the construction site, are mainly done manually. Thus, green and fired bricks are handled at least four or five times before they reach the customer. This causes heavy breakages and severe damage to brick edges and a lot of dust. The present labour-intensive status of the brick industry in India is very similar to the one that existed in the Netherlands during the last century. Today, all handling has been fully mechanised in the Netherlands and the mason is the first and the last person who touches bricks with his bare hands. To mechanise brick handling, the Dutch invented a way to move bricks in dense packs without a supporting pallet. The bottom row, or legs, of the pack had gaps through which forks or fingers of a gripper or grab could enter. When the pack is lifted, the fingers support the upper layers while movable and spring-loaded pads coming out of the fingers hold the lowest row or legs laterally. This pack setting and gripper design allowed the brick packs to be lifted, carried and placed easily as required, from brick stockyard to brick transport vehicle. This way of brick handling became a huge success in the Netherlands and all brick makers followed this method of storage and movement of bricks. Brick transport companies use these dedicated grippers attached to small cranes to move fired bricks out of the stockyard. Brick makers use similar grippers attached to forklifts to move brick packs within their premises. These brick packs are very stable. They do not need supporting pallets, wrapping or strapping during movement, which results in huge cost savings. The successes lead to the use of the same concept for loading and unloading of kilns as well. At many places, kiln packs are set outside the kiln and then they are carried into the kiln by grippers attached to forklifts. Unloading of fired brick packs from kilns is also done by the same forklift with grippers. After these packs are loaded onto trucks and delivered at construction site, The building contractors lift and place them onto raised levels of scaffolding using similar crane grippers and attachments for telescopic handlers. Mechanical handling of bricks with the De Boer gripper is fast, safe and cost effective. The De Boer gripper, a revolutionary tool for handling bricks.